is uh, part two of my Never Wear Nice 2 videos. I'm going to continue where I left off. I'm playing Drilling You Elias, the Moon Elf. Very close. Multi classed. Thief type character. Well, not even close to a thief. Or so. It's uh, early in the morning. It's like three something, I think. Maybe, yeah, three, three something. I, I woke up at 1 30 this morning. Give my bearings here for a minute. I'm already, I'm already ready to go. Seems. I just wear gloves of concentration for now. I'm about to get greater gloves of concentration. Want to sk get skill focus intimidate and skill focus appraise. <laughs> Be a real thug, man. Thug life. No. <laughs> you give my bluff up. I got to. I got fiend. Is that right there? I'm not quite sure what it does. I know what it does, but yeah, I'm gonna have to get that up. complicated skill that one is. Let's go meet Kelgar Iron Fist. I try not to smoke so much on this one. Now that we're outside, maybe you'd like to tell me what you said again. Slowly this time, so you could think about what you're saying. You're a small one to be taking this road all by yourself, dwarf. Maybe you've come looking for trouble. Unless you have a little coin to convince us otherwise. No need to trouble the elf. I believe all of you were threatening me. If you ever decide to throw a punch, that is. Even a stranger can see you're too scared of your own shadows to do it. Is that so? Maybe both of you should pay. How about that? Come on. Someone tried to hit me already. Even the newcomer here sees that you're all too afraid to do anything. All right, I've heard enough of this. Come on, boys. Let's deal with the dwarf and his new friend. <coughs> Yeah! 
Well now, that was a good fight. A shame they had to resort to weapons. Uh, but if they have to keep the odds even, can't blame them too much. Have to admit, wasn't expecting an elf to come along. Or to pitch in like that. Name's Kelgar, by the way. Of the clan Iron Fist. I've been making my way along the coast for some time now. Stopped in the willow here for a brief fight. Ah! Well, you could have fooled me. You handled yourself pretty well. Almost as well as I did, but that's a high mark to reach for. So, tell me, what brings you out along the mare? Roads aren't exactly safe, you know, and they're getting worse all the time. Now, now, didn't mean to start another fight. Especially when we have such a fine tavern before us that has some untapped kegs we haven't fought yet. I say we step inside the Weeping Willow here and share our stories over a few of the innkeeper's best. So then I punched him in the face for asking. And while he was trying to pick his teeth off the floor, his friend decided to add a few choice words about my heritage. So I punched him too. So to make a long story short, I take pride in what I do, fighting. It's something you can't get enough of, and it's something where there's always room for improvement. If you apply yourself, stay focused, and keep swinging. And that's why I'm headed to Neverwinter. I heard there's a house of monks there. A monastery, right? Kelgar rules. I heard they'll train anyone just for the asking. Couldn't ask for a better opportunity. If you know of a closer one that'll train for free, well, I'm all ears. Just as long as I get that monk training. Don't you worry. There's nothing sordid or unseemly about the tale. Well, as it happens, I didn't always want to become a monk. What happened was that... It... The Kalacha! Find it! Well, look at this! Our next round of practice just arrived! Glory conforms! <clears throat> Take that! Glory conforms! All right! good like my last video just so much easier to be chaotic good in this game so easy I gotta do to be chaotic and good
to deviate. to carry. step follow me Chilling here playing this game. Shut this door. Fix the camera. I don't know if I've been in here, but I gotta look this way. 
Something wrong with my middle mouse button on this Death Adder mouse from Razer. It doesn't work. Can't even use it on web pages for some reason. Seven, what the fuck? Shields. choose that or the longbow, I'm not sure which. I use a longbow. I'd find it. Yeah, I use a longbow. Short bow. I sell the shield. Um, 
Archer Ken. Is that a long sword? It's a great sword. I'm about to pick up the Astral Blade pretty soon here. It's a really nice long sword. It's held by the uh, Bandit Captain. The Bandit Cam. <coughs> Magic pouch. I can go ahead and get that. I use it to hold something on them. Well now, I've had a good time so far, and the way you attract trouble. I haven't had this much fun since that tavern back at Bogan's Pass where I was using that trestle table as a battering ram. Well, oh, look, we're heading in the same direction, and you seem to have more enemies than friends. What say we travel together? Might be able to teach each other a few things. Insane? Maybe one too many blows to the head, but I've toughened up since then. But let me prove it to you. So what do you say? You don't even have to ask. I don't steal another man's kill. Well, not on purpose anyway. And don't you worry about me keeping up. Kelgar Iron Fist carries his own weight. I won't be slowing you down. That son, though. Da, 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 it's moving. Yep. <laughs> Optical illusion. I went to bed at like, what was it? Eight, seven, something like that. Woke up at 1.30. I started uploading the video that I made the last video of this game. It's still uploading. It's like maybe 50 something percent done. And I'm on the fast, I'm on fast as internet too. I don't, I don't know. It's never shown any signs of slowing down up until now. I guess it's found its words. This game looks a lot better when it's not behind shades. <laughs> what can I say for this incursion? Visibility back. 
No, I smoke a lot and apologize for that. Crafter than be pretty useful, but I'm not. But as awesome as this game is, I don't like crafting very much. It's useful though. I want to craft like those explosive AOE things. Alchemist fire, acid flax, tangle foot bags. Don't use those. Powder, choking powder, that's it. Not on this difficulty anyway, because it'll just screw it. <laughs> it'll mess up the whole battlefield. Um, you'll be dazed, your companions will be dazed, and your enemies will be dazed. It's useless. I guess you could use tactically, I don't know. Use it tactically. Them buffs though. Glory comforters. If you're a cleric, just hit this spontaneous conversion button. Let's see. Cure moderate wounds is the second level spell, so any spell you cast on that. Okay. Let's see. Wanna wanna cast cure moderate wounds on yourself? Or an ally? Go ahead and do it. Bonaparte. Cure light wounds? Go ahead and do it. Make sure clerics can heal. <laughs> Make use of that. Glory Comporus. Glory Comporus. Particularly close to a level up yet. Prostrofa Dixit.
It's a fight for survival. Bless last little good woman. I hate that. Glory conforms. Glory conforms. What, demon? No screams for us? Maybe we should brand you. Maybe that'll loosen your tongue. Leave me alone! I've done nothing to you. Well, now Commander Valus will be happy to hear that he will. It means his work here is all done. He can just give up the fort and go home. Still, there's just the small matter of those bounties on bandits he posted. And a bandit with demon blood. Well, there's no telling how much that's worth. Of course, you could tell us where your camp is. Valus will pay more for that, he will. And we won't even have to butcher the lot of you. I told you I'm not with those bandits. Or are you deaf and stupid? Stupid? Here we were, thinking about letting you live. Now you've gone and changed our minds. Huh, hold on, look at this. An elf and a dwarf, maybe friends of hers. This don't concern you. We're soldiers from Fort Lock, hunting bandits. That we are. Caught this demon trying to raid our camp, and we were about to deal with her. Nothing yet, but a crew's been out in these parts. They've been raiding merchants, caravans, maybe even killed the old commander. I told you I'm not with those bandits. Shut your lying mouth, demon. You'll get the blade soon enough. Oh, really? Well, isn't that all high and mighty of you? You know, Valis might pay for three bandit bounties. He's not one for asking questions. Especially about a demon, a runty dwarf, and a dirty harbourman who doesn't know enough to keep walking! Runty dwarf? I know you cowards aren't talking to me, or you'll be talking to my fist next! Good enough for me. Let's kill them all and I'll sort out the tale later. Ha 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 Come on, Nishka. No me capot. This blood. Guess that's what they get for underestimating an elf, eh? Last mistake they'll make. Sorry if I sounded surprised. It's just, you know, people don't usually help me out like that. Especially, um, well, people like you. You know, nice-looking people. 
Does that make me a damsel in distress? Oh, I hope not. I hate those women. Yeah, lucky me, huh? Better to be lucky than good. Someone told me that once. It's a good way to think about things sometimes, you know? I mean, once folks catch sight of me, usually it's the horns, they run in the other direction. And all those tales about tieflings being cursed don't help much either. I'm Nishka, by the way. I'm really glad you came when you did. I wasn't really sure how I'd get out of that one. Of course, they never would have caught me in the first place if that invisibility potion I'd bought hadn't been watered down. If I ever see that merchant again... Well, I was actually trying to pass the fort by. Make my way farther south. Well, I thought that potion I bought would help. You see, once the local garrison sees me, they tend to want to throw me in a cell or attack me on sight. Of course, the potion wears off right as I cross paths with those thugs from Fort Locke. They were looking for easy bounties, and I showed up right on time. It's been that way ever since the new Fort Commander posted bounties on bandits. Some of his soldiers have been hunting down anyone they find on the road and claiming they're bandits. It's just banditry of a different sort. They rob the travelers and then get the bounty too. The roads are even less safe now than they were before. Hoodie on. I might have to. We'll see. Yeah. I guess you don't have any reason to stay. Look, th thanks for saving me. Really? Do you. Uh, do you think I could join you? Just for now. I won't get in the way, I promise. It's just that I don't know how long I can survive on my own. And, well. I do owe you one. Can't say I trust her. Tieflings will stab you in the back and run off with your purse the moment you drop your guard. Yeah? Well, dwarves are squat, smelly drunks who'll chop someone in half just to show they're tough. Oh, is that so? Well, why don't you step down here and say that again? Oh, this'll be fair. I don't even have any of my gear. But please, let me come with you. I owe you for saving me. And those soldiers will just try to kill me again if they catch me out here on my own. Thanks. I won't let you down, I swear. I think those Fort Lock thugs have my gear locked away here. Loot. I need as many of those healing or healer kits as I can get. Especially since I'm going to that graveyard with those undead zombies and stuff. Mm. We 
fight. <laughs> I'm gonna do that. Who's for a fight? Come on! What? What is it? Plus, eventually, I just, um, like that merchant in High Cliff who sells the plus one healing kits. I just get huge amounts of those and just heal all my party members in battle with those healing kits. Works really good. Let's go ahead and save. I'm gonna keep this save with the number one in it just in case um, Rogue and Cleric don't work out. In case I do need those extra spells, those little three spells, I'm not sure. For so <laughs> nothing I can buy. <laughs> Muscle with that. What's Perry? Yeah, I don't need to use Perry in this game. Not even. Screen's popping. What's, what's it doing? Mess it up or something. Wonder why. Wonder blob of acid kit. There's some traps I can buy. Something to use that magic pouch for later. I can sell this time. Okay, all about that. Game's messing up. Doing some kind of weird thing, right? Got vertical sync turned on. <sighs> I'm not sure why it's doing that.
Well, I've never persuaded that dude before. I'm going to go ahead and end this video, make it shorter than the last one. I think it's shorter, I'm not really sure. Priest of Illmater. Think if I should do the bandit thing. No, I'll do it later. Make this video shorter than the last one. At least I think it's shorter. I'm not quite sure. Okay, see you later.